Hey you guys and welcome back for your weekly little Joe where I am your girl Joe. I'm your girl. I am your girl, okay? Um, I'm super excited and super coffee up, <laughs> so forgive me. I am super excited because I get to do a review that is close and near and dear to my heart. Not only is this review close and near and dear to my heart, the person who is providing the product is really close and near and dear to my heart. So I have decided, I have decided that, you know, I really want to give you guys a thorough review of black products and black services. And so I figured a lot of us are at home, we ain't doing a whole lot of nothing except for taking in social media. And so while we all here supporting some of these influencers and social media people, you know, I want to see, I want to see how they do business. Right, I, I, I'm looking and seeing. I, you know, I want to peep everybody. I want to peep the small businesses, the big businesses, the influencers, the people who just getting started. Like I'm here for it, babe. Um, so wrap it up. What I've decided to do is I've decided to go and take three to five influencers who are either close and near and dear to my heart, or you know, just popped up on the screen one day, and I'm very interested in getting to see how they run their businesses. So with all of that being said, I am doing a lip gloss review. I know, right? I'm so excited. I haven't done a lip gloss review on here yet. So here's my disclaimer. I actually already recorded this video yesterday. Like, I've been on it. But the lighting was horrible. Today, we giving you glowing melanin, right? We giving you cocoa shea butter, you know what I'm saying, lighting. So I figured since I'm in a good mood and I'm coffeeed up and the day is beautiful and I'm alive and healthy, I'd run this review to you guys one more time and try to refilm it. So here I am. Okay. So the lip gloss review, if you, like I said, a lot of y'all are on social media anyway. A lot of you guys are watching YouTube. And if y'all don't know, let me be the first one. Let me, because I'm your girl, let me be the first one to put y'all on in 2021. Baby, if you don't know about no honey veins, not the snack, though she is a snack though. If you don't know about no honey buns, baby, where have you been, like, baby? Okay, so let me be the first to tell you, honey buns is the shit. I said it. And I'll probably never get monetized because I cuss a lot. But that's neither here nor there. So honey buns is everything. Honey buns will give you life. Honey buns will give you tea. Honey buns will give you looks, wigs, slay, all of it, okay? And this time, honey buns is going to give you lip gloss. So I actually found Honey Bun's channel on here on YouTube, here on YouTube, um, when the YouTube algorithm suggests somebody for you. So I click, 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 because you know, most of us be clicking because we nosy, bitch. I'm nosy. I'm nosy and immediately, like immediately, like Honey Bun's page was popping, like pop, pop, popping, okay? Um, and so, here's my other disclaimer. If you're homophobic, you don't like black folks, you don't like transgenders, like, don't don't come here. Like, this is not the page for you. And, and I use the terminology, she, even though this is a boy who is more on the feminine side. Now, I'm using the terminology, she, because I'm pretty sure that she's okay with me using this terminology. Honey buns, baby, if you watch this video and you're not, Keep down in the comments and check me, babe. I'm here for it. So another reason that Honey Buns is close and near to my heart, cause Aries, Aries gang, 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 we Aries gang. So once I found out she was Aries and then I got addicted to the video, bitch, it only made sense. It only made logical black sense to buy the lip gloss. Now, she also sells waist beads, but you know I gotta pace myself. I gotta pace myself. So I decided to go ahead and purchase the lip gloss, okay? Now, the very first thing I noticed is that Honey Buns, even though you're a first time entrepreneur, and check, check, get in the comments and check me, babe. Get in the comments and check me if I'm wrong. 
because you are a first time entrepreneur or even though you are a first time entrepreneur, your customer service, A1 banging slapper, like you go. Um, you responded to me, she responded to me in a timely manner. She was polite, friendly, she wasn't big headed and bougie and all that other stuff. I remember asking a lot of questions and it got to the point so where I even had to apologize for asking so many questions because you know, I know our bitch is booked and busy. Okay, <laughs> bitch, and if you ain't booked and busy, you finna be booked and busy. So I apologize for asking so many questions and she just was like so friendly, so kind, so nice. And you know, I'm here for it. I'm here for the good customer service, bitch. <laughs> so once we got over talking through DM, cause you know, I actually reached out under one of her pictures on her Instagram and said, hey, man, you know, like, I love the lip gloss. Like, I need me some of that. She responded back to me and jumped in my DM. Didn't wait for me to jump in her DM. Like, she responded back to me and was like, hey, like, you need it. I can be your plug. So, the conversation went great back and forth. I was highly pleased. Um, when she told me the price of the lip gloss, I was pleased. I was pleased. And so, this was December 29th. By the time I'm re-recording this for you guys, it is January 13th, I believe. The lip gloss got to me from North Carolina in about a week or so. So, the packaging, the time that it got here was okay. And then, um, the packaging, there goes, let it slip. The packaging is bomb too. So, let's get into the packaging. Let's get into the product review. Let's get, as Honey Buns would say, let's get into it. So, First off, the very first thing that I noticed is this packaging, which I really like. I, I like the bubble wrap. Um, I even like it when it's pink or different colors and I get the packages from other places, but I really, really like this. And honey buns, you pay for, you pay for shipping? Yeah, you the one. So anyways, um, the very first thing, like I said, I've done, I read, I already recorded this video, so, you know, I gotta act surprised, so just go along with me. Um, so the very first lip gloss that Perfect. I pulled out was this clear lip gloss. So, you know, I'm here for good customer service, I'm here for great products, but the packaging is super, 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 super cute. Not only did she add a little bit of pink and purple, which is some of my favorite colors, um, I really like the hylographic, hylographic, hylographic. I'm saying that wrong. Packaging that kind of matches this. I really like that. And the lip gloss is, this is a large lip gloss. She has two lip glosses. One is the large, which is $10, and the other one, I believe, is $7. Now, I am old school, okay? I'm old school, I'm new school, I'm a little bit of a mix of both. I really like handwritten packaging. I really like handwritten notes or thank you notes. Like I'm a fan for it, but I've never, ever, 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 ever seen this. And I really, really, really like this. You see honey buns? Do you see that honey bun? Do you see honey buns there? Get it focused. She wrote her like initials on the package with a little crown, bitch. And my lovely tea voice, I'm here for it. So, the lip gloss looks like this. It is, I love the packaging as well. I like the clear, I like the fact that you can see right through the bottle. Let's get, let's get into it. First thing I noticed about this lip gloss was the smell. If you like pina coladas and going out in the rain. Okay, so this pina colada smell baby mm, like <laughs> delicious like it smells really good honey buns you did smell this pina colada smell baby and i know you be sipping i be watching your channels i i've been binge watching your channel so i know you be sipping you be sipping that pina colada you, you be sipping look because you got you got the smell down so let's try it because you know I ain't got no lip gloss for this video, and I can use it. My lips getting like a crabby patty. So the first thing I noticed, Perfect. other than the smell, and you can smell the, I like the fact that you can smell it on your lips. I like that, is that it's a really lightweight formula. 
mm, yeah i like the lightweight formula i like the lightweight formula it's not sticky at all mm, mm, mm. and i like the fact that it's really buildable right so you don't because like if you've seen honey bunch channel her lifting stop 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 popping um i like the fact that you just get a little bit of gloss but like if you want gloss gloss like honey bun gloss you just dip in, scoop you some more out. You see it? You see her? Baby, I love me a good lip gloss. When the matte lipsticks and stuff came out that wasn't for me, my lips are really, 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 really dry. And so I've always been a fan of the popping lip gloss. You know, that's back in the day. That's back in the day. Um, I've always been a fan of popping lip gloss i love me a lip gloss that's not sticky i love me a lip gloss that smells smells good um lightweight formulated like i love it and this is a great lip gloss to put on top of like your favorite lip color like maybe if you like matte lipsticks and you have a few left and you want to slip up switch over to like the lip gloss look this is definitely a lip gloss that you can do that with i Yep, I'm here for it. The smell got me hooked though, y'all. Like the package is what like got me here, but the smell got me hooked. Mm. How do you guys like? You did that, bitch. Okay, so let's get into the second lip gloss because I know y'all waiting. I know y'all anticipating. I know y'all anticipating. Okay, so let's get into the second lip gloss. Let me wipe this off real quick. Okay, so I've wiped off the second lip gloss. Let's get into the second one. So before we get into the second one, it's, let me tell you, honey man, because you know I've been watching your channel, baby. I see you sipping, and I heard you don't sip smoke. I hope you, I heard that you don't partake in the 420 festivities too much. You be trying, you be dibbling and dabbling, but it's not really for you. Um, I don't know if your friends didn't let you know. But baby, this is a wee bag. Like, this is a wee, this is a wee bag. So that's even more why I love the packaging because I'm a, I'm a smoker. Don't panic, it's organic. Like I, I'm here for the 420. So I love the fact that this is actually a weed packet. So I can put my weed in there when I'm done. So anyways, this, this second packaging has the same thing. Cute inside hand initials and this one is a pink one now the other one the clear one didn't have sparkles this one does okay can't see it this one has glitter in it it's like gold flex glitter it doesn't look like really big glitter i am not really a fan for lip glosses that have glitter in them it's just not really my thing like i said i have a really dry lip so i don't need anything that's going to cut or chop or do anything extra to my lips that I don't need done but as honey buns would say let's get into it okay see if this has the same bang and smell okay now this one is like a little more bubble it smells like bubble gum like maybe a mix of bubble gum and pina colada but definitely has a smell to it maybe more on the bubble gum side yeah maybe more on the bubble gum side with a little pina colada but bitch I'm here for it same lightweight formula as the first one you do not I, I do not feel not one speck of glitter in it not one and if my eyes don't deceive me it still got that popping shine like Am I wrong? I don't know. Did I get it wrong? Did I get it wrong? No, I didn't. It still got that shine. Y'all see her? Y'all see her? Okay, so I'm sure you can tell through the video. Bitch, I am here for these lip glosses. Honey Bun is the first influencer, and she's a smaller influencer, and probably. Yeah, she's a smaller influencer that I picked thus far. Um, and the first one that I picked, and baby, 
So once they have to follow behind you, like, God bless them. May black Jesus bless them, okay? Because these are slappers. These are bangers. I want to go ahead and commend you, especially because I truly believe that you're a first-time, first-generation entrepreneur. You killed it. You killed it. Now, for the ones who may not like the light lip gloss, you may want to come up with like a stickier formula, but I, myself, I love this. This is definitely a winter, spring, summer type of lip gloss. I love the popping. I love the fact that it, the pink doesn't come with color either, but I like that because I can pick my own lipstick color and then put this on top or pick another lip gloss that has color to it and then just put this on for an extra shine. Um, you were super professional. She was she was super professional. She was friendly. The packaging was great and the product was a slapper. So do I recommend Honey Bun's lip gloss? Yes. Now the other thing that I noticed that was in this package is that and I don't know if she did it on purpose or not, but we're gonna give baby girl credit for um we gonna give baby girl credit. She also added these little sticky things in here so I'm guessing I can write the name on them and label them myself and added a few extra so I guess if the label runs off or the it wipes off you can add a little extra great customer service like I said the packaging was great the product was great the customer service was great her channel is great go check her out I'm really excited like really excited like this is gonna be don't be surprised if you see me putting this on my next videos like don't come for me because I didn't call you but in any case this is a slapper. This is a banger. Great job, honey buns. I am super pleased and super happy that one, you were my first one. You were my first influencer that I reviewed your product. And second, I'm glad that you set the bar. Like, like sis is glad that you set the bar because this is a banger. So, you know, I'm done with my review. I gotta do my spill. If any of you guys know somebody, uh oh, that's my phone. If you know somebody who's doing something dope in the community, has a great product and great customer service, somebody black, Negro, colored, melanin, whatever it is you want to call them, wherever they all over the world, if they are doing something dope in the community, have a great product and great customer service, please leave their information down below because I love, I love reviewing black owned businesses. We don't get enough shine. And if you don't know, baby, we got next and after next. Okay? Okay, you guys, I will see you back for your next refill of Joe.